Hello, everyone. Welcome to my school. It's grammar time. Today we'll we'll be parsing and diagramming a sentence. And here, I have a sentence. First step, let's check our mechanics. We have to make sure that all of our five parts of a sentence are there. So, do we have a subject? Yes, it's our implied or assumed you. Although you cannot see it, it's there. Do we have a verb? Yes, weep is our verb. Do we have a capital letter? Actually, we have two capital letters. Next, do we have an end mark? Yep, right here. Do we have, does it make complete sense? Yes, it does. Now let's move on to our question confirmation. In order to find out the role of each word in a sentence, we have to ask our question confirmation. First, we'll, let's read our sentence. You weep with the joy of the Lord. Who weep? You. Subject pronoun. What's being said about you? You weep. Verb. Weep how? With the joy. Prepositional phrase. Adverbial. Weep with what? Joy. Object of the preposition. Which joy? The article adjective. Which joy? Of the Lord. Prepositional phrase adjectival. Of what? Lord. Object of the preposition. Which Lord? The article adjective. Now let's move on to our sentence classification. So let's find out what sentence structure this is. Do we have a coordinate conjunction? No, so it's not a compound. Do we have a subordinate conjunction? No, so it's not a complex. Do we have a who which clause? No, so it's a simple sentence. Because this is a command sentence and we have an implied you, we call this an imperative. Now, let's find out what the pattern is. So, we have a subject and a verb, but our verb does not transfer the action from the subject to an object, so it's a verb intransitive. So, our pattern is subject, verb intransitive, or SVI. Now, let's move on to diagramming. So, how we diagram is we first will draw a horizontal line and a vertical line all the way through. And then, we'll write our implied yield. And the weep is going to be over here. And then we're going to draw a diagonal line. And then we're going to put the word with. Then from here, we're going to do another line. And joy, we're going to put joy over here. And then two diagonal lines. The. And then of. Then we're going to draw another line and then we're going to put Lord. And then another diagonal line and then we put the. And that's how you diagram this sentence. So I'll see you next time. Bye!